checking the stats every minute this week. I'm doing my part, I'm paying attention, and I play my position. It's Crypto Lightsaber back with another daily Zen update. We're going to talk about the price of Zen, which is moving just as I predicted in yesterday's video. And more specifically, I want to talk about the DXN token or DXN, sorry, DXN, uh, DBZen. Uh, I did go ahead and get a stake in this protocol um, because I want some of those Ethereum fees. Um, there's just so much hype around the DXN token as well that it can't be ignored in my opinion paying out about 400% APY as well so um, yeah let's see what my dividends look like when it's all said and done uh, you can see I have a stake I've staked about 85 tokens 85.92 so just under 86 DXN tokens and um, that should pay me some Ethereum dividends okay um, I had to pull the trigger guys um, I didn't actually burn Zen to get into it. I actually just bought it. Um, you know, um, maybe that weren't the greatest idea, but um, you say me having to pay fees and you know having to burn Zen, and it was just basically I had some Ethereum and I just bought I bought some DB Zen with it rather than buying Zen and then uh, burning Zen. And you know that is the correct strategy. Don't follow me. All right, burn Zen. Of course, contribute to the ecosystem. And so I'm still contributing to the ecosystem, in my opinion. But I just went ahead and bought the tokens and staked them, you know. Um, so, yeah, I've got some DB Zen now. And we'll see what the dividends are looking like. The price of Zen still pumping, still moving up, just as we said yesterday. Um, this was just a minor pullback, okay. And I believe we're probably going to see more upside. I would love to see this going parabolic, okay. It is kind of going parabolic, but when you zoom out, right, um, it's not really done much yet. Okay, I can see this coming all the way up here, breaking past that level, going absolutely crazy. That would be wonderful. But DBZen is an interesting token. Some people are saying it's like Hex. Uh, Jack Levin, I believe, says it's better than Hex. And, you know, would you want to miss out on something that was potentially better than Hex? Um, I just had to buy some. Okay. And, um, you know, if it goes crazy, I will take some profits, take out my initial investment, leave a stake in there, earn some Ethereum, and so on. There's a strategy for everybody. That's just my strategy. Okay, guys. So, um, yeah, DB Zen um, quickly becoming a very uh, sought after token. If we go to the chart for DB Zen, so you can see right now it's sitting at $73. Now, when we zoom out, right, you can see that DB Zen came up, it came down, came up, came down. Seems to be consolidating. It's like a stable coin right now. It's just going sideways. And I think once we break out at this level, we're probably going to take out a previous all-time high. So, um, yeah, I can see um, a huge multiplier in this. Liquidity is low. It's still super low cap at 12.3 million. Price is $73, of course. I think this will be even more bullish if it was, if it had a lot of zeros as well. So people just People just gravitate towards the low prices. You know, they, they gravitate towards being able to get millions of tokens for a couple of dollars. But, you know, it can't be the same for everything. DBZen, you know, it started off, I think it was around a dollar. I said three dollars here. Maybe it was three dollars. But it's gone all the way to $73. So the price that I'm buying it at is, you know, far from a, you know, <laughs> far from a great price, to be honest. From where it was down here, you know, that's where I should have been buying this. It's done about... I don't know, what's it done? About a 30x, about 30x. Um, but, you know, better late than never, I guess. And, you know, could could this potentially go to $700 a 10x? I'll be happy with that. Okay, I'll be happy with that while receiving dividends at the same time. So, you know, Zen, super bullish on this, of course. You know, <laughs> guys, if you're not subscribed to the channel by now, I'm not sure what you're doing. But, you know, this is quickly becoming a Zen. Yeah, like, this is my... This is probably my favorite coin, my favorite altcoin right now, okay, which, which is why I continue to make videos on it, okay. Zen market cap is sitting at around 77 million. Let's just check on coin market cap, make sure that everything tallies up. 74 million, okay. Um, I mean, yeah, guys, doing pretty well. Um, it did get closer to that, you know, taking out that zero. Once it actually did take out a zero. I made a video the other day saying that Zen was going to kill a zero. It actually did kill a zero, but then it pulled back. Okay, this was back up to around 
90, 91, 92, um, just earlier today, back down to about 85, is holding a strong support up here, really, to be honest. It's, it's not, you know, it's not just getting sold off, okay? Uh, people are buying the dips, they're buying the pullbacks, okay? Um, it's uh, If we could break this level, I think we, we get a massive move to the upside. But in the short term, it could come down, it could come down. But, um, you know, we just don't know, we just don't know, guys, but... You know, ultimately, this is a long-term play. Where's this going to be in two years' time? People are talking about a 10,000x, like Hex did. Uh, even if it done a 1,000x, I've said it in a previous video. Even if it did a 1,000x, even if it only does a 100x, I'm going to be sitting pretty. Even if this only does a 10x, you're going to be making crazy gains. You don't see gains like that in the stock market. This has already gone up about a 5, 6x from the bottom. If we do a measured move. Done around, oh, a 10x. Zen has actually done a 10x. Where is anybody seeing gains like that in the traditional markets? That's why I love crypto so much. But um, yeah, I believe this can do a lot more. But um, you can't be surprised when pullbacks come because after something 10x is probably going to be some profit takers. Okay. Some would say that we're silly for not taking profits for holding, but you know, ultimately, a long term strategy is crush it in this crypto market. So. Volumes looking good, charts looking good, um, ecosystems looking good. There are tokens, other tokens that I've talked about briefly, even tokens I've not talked about yet uh, that are you know contributing to this ecosystem. So I can see this whole ecosystem growing, especially when the X1 mainnet comes out and goes live. I think we're going to get massive gains out of Zen. Just my opinion. Let me know what you think in the comments. Do me a favor, subscribe to the channel, tick the little bell, uh, like the comment, like the video. Sorry, that helps with the YouTube algorithm. And I'll see you in the next one.